Hi guys, Colsey, and today we're going to be talking about gaming PCs, and we're actually going to be planning out slash designing a PC, I guess. But not just any PC from anywhere, because we can do that anytime. We're going to be doing it using Wish. Wish.com is a website and an app that claim to be one of those places that you can buy like super cheap, just just stuff from and and they claim to be cheap and like you can get a lot of things for like a pound generally the stuff turns out to be uh, a little bit a little bit on the cheaper side a little bit crappy wish sell a lot of different things including pc hardware i'm gonna be honest i've been through wish and the selection of pc hardware isn't great i'm gonna be honest there's not a lot but i think i've managed to cobble together a working gaming pc we're gonna have a look at the parts, we're gonna have a look at how much it costs, and I'm gonna be honest, some of it we are gonna judge its reliability and its legitimacy heavily. And of course at the end what we're gonna do is we're gonna compare the cost, the performance of the PC we build on Wish to something that you can buy from a very reputable, you know, PC builder, which we're gonna use Fierce PC. Okay, so. The main parts of the PC that we're gonna need, we're gonna need a CPU with a cooler and stuff. We're gonna need a motherboard, which that CPU fits to. We're gonna need at least a hard drive. So we're just gonna go with a hard drive. We're gonna go for a terabyte hard drive. We're gonna need RAM. So we're gonna go with eight gigabytes of RAM, whichever you know fits the CPU and the motherboard combination. We're gonna need a power supply and we're gonna want a graphics card. First thing I searched for was a CPU. The CPU that I found, and I'm gonna be honest, is the only CPU that even came up when I was looking on Wish, is an AMD Ryzen 3 2200G. So one thing I'm concerned about slightly is the, it says cut, I don't know what that means. Um, and then it says R3 1400. So then I was like, does it, but, but it's supposed to be a Ryzen 3 2200. So is it an R3 2200? Did they type that wrong? Is that a mistake? So I searched up for an AMD R3 1400. Turns out that doesn't exist. I mean, they made an R5 1400, which is a generation earlier, but they didn't make an R3 1400. So that actually just doesn't exist. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna trust, well, we're not gonna trust. We're gonna, we're gonna say that it's an R3 2200. Now, as with some other things here, if you order it and it turns up, it may just not be the thing you ordered anyway. So, you know. Just take that with a grain of salt and I am not recommended you buy from Wish by any means. That's the CPU we're going with. So we need a motherboard that, that fits. So the one I have located is this one. It's a MSI B350M Pro M80X AM4 motherboard. Apparently uh, this should be suitable for that CPU. So, and it's an MSI, so at least that is a brand I have heard of. It's 151 pounds, which I think is probably a little expensive on the expensive side. I have tried to not look any of these up. I don't want to Google the prices and find out like, you can just buy this on eBay for like 50 quid. No, we're just gonna go with this. All right, next we have the hard drive. So we've just gone with a terabyte hard drive. It doesn't give us a brand, just says it's a 7200 RPM, one terabyte hard drive. Uh, you can actually choose like one terabyte or two terabytes, but for some reason, the price doesn't change. Even though technically two of those, two one terabyte hard drives, would be a two terabyte hard drive, but apparently it's the same price. So for, that's just terrible for starters. So we're just gonna go with the cheaper one and we're gonna go with the one terabyte hard drive. You assume it's gonna be new, but who the heck knows? It says new, it says 99% new, 99% new. I don't know what that means. So we'll probably get the 1% that's not new if we ordered it. So again, who knows? Also, it's trying to tell me that a one terabyte hard drive is worth 406 pounds absolute bullshit. On to RAM. So we're going with some base, I don't know how to pronounce this, Vasky, Vasky, I don't know how to pronounce it. Again, it's it's the same as the hard drive. Uh, we can pick eight gigs, which is 25 pounds, or four gigs, which is 25 pounds, but we want eight gigs, so we're gonna go with that, and we're gonna just assume that it is 25 pounds. I don't know, I don't understand. It is confusing me too. This is obviously not working. I'm gonna double, I'm gonna add all these to the cart and then I'm gonna double check it on my phone what the price comes out as because I know that the app works significantly better than the website. This is the RAM we're going with, 2400 megahertz, eight gigabytes of DDR4 RAM. It says that's what it is. We're gonna trust that's what it is. But who the hell knows? It could turn up and not be that. You're gonna find that that is the case with a lot of these things. You don't know what you're getting. It's gonna turn up in like a month. 
Oh, it's a pain. Okay, on to the power supply now. Um, I'm gonna say straight off the bat, if it's don't, just don't cheap out on your power supply. Don't, please don't, because if your power supply goes badly wrong, it can break everything else in your PC, and that is not what you want. It will ruin everything. Buy a reputable name brand power supply. Don't skimp on it. Don't skimp on the cost just because it you can't, you know, you haven't got a big budget. Make sure you get a decent power supply, please. I just I just can't I can't I can't understand why anyone would buy this. I can't understand it. But anyway, this is the only power supply, uh, PC power supply that they sell on Wish.com. 500 watts, I assume, power supply is the power supply. It should work. It's 21 pounds. That's too cheap. Like that, you, it's a brand you've never heard of. It says here 80 plus certification, but anywhere on like the actual pictures, I don't see the 80 plus certification logo. So that's. That's freaking me out. Problem here, right, I was searching for computer case. Turns out they don't sell cases. I assume it's because they're big and they're bulky and they would make no money out of it. It would be too expensive to ship. So they don't do cases, so we're just gonna add like a fairly cheap case price just onto the wish order. Okay, onto GPU. Now this is always fun. So a lot of people have made these kind of videos in the past, but they actually will buy the parts and build a wish uh, PC. Now, graphics cards always a fun thing because you always see these graphics card prices and uh, them being marketed ridiculously cheaply for what is a good graphics card. So, uh, and obviously they turn out in, I think every case I've ever seen, they're not the graphics card. They are faked. 1060, uh, we can order any of these. Again, the price doesn't change. So we'll just go for a 1066 gig because that would be cool, wouldn't it? If we got a 1066 gig for 47 pounds, it's not gonna happen, uh, just so we're all aware. Even the reviews are bad. Like two and a half stars is not a good review. Let's grab the calculator real quick, shall we? Calculator, here we go. Why is that calculator so fucking big? Now this is curious because I'm pretty sure that the RAM was not 43 pounds, but apparently it is 43 pounds. So 43 pounds for the RAM. 62, again, that wasn't the price we were shown, but 62 for the graphics card. So that comes to a total of 472. Right, let me double check that on my phone. And also my phone is gonna be able to give me a shipping total. Item total, 472 pounds. You ready for this? Shipping, 60 pounds, that's right. All those £10 shipping costs, we have to pay each of those. They can't like add them together and ship it all together. No, 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 no. £532. That's our total to buy all those and get them shipped here. Now, we haven't got everything we need. As we discussed, we don't have a PC case. So let's just add, say, let's say we order that. It's on Prime. Uh, £23. £23 for the case. That's £555. Uh, also, this obviously doesn't come with a Windows 10 key, so that's going to cost you at least an extra. Now, I know that there are places that you can buy uh, Windows 10 for cheaper, but it is not a, you know, it's not a legitimate copy or a legitimate way to do it. Whatever, that's up to you to decide. We're going to go with this. So let's say £70. We're going to say if we prime ourselves a Windows 10 key for £70. So that puts our total to £625 shipped, delivered, done. Bought from Wish.com. Now that doesn't seem like a cheap price to me. That's Wish.com, the idea of Wish is that it's supposed to be like a cheap place that you can buy stuff. This doesn't even seem cheap. And half the stuff is either unreliable, probably fake, probably won't be what it says it is, and it's not worth it. So, with our £625 budget, let's have a look at what we can buy on Fierce PC, shall we? A very, very reputable, reliable, and great place to buy PCs. Let's check them out. So the CPU we would we would be ordering from Wish.com was a Ryzen 3 2200G, I believe is what it said. So the closest equivalent to the PC that we built is the Red Ronin. So. It has an AMD Ryzen 3 2300X, so that already is a improvement on the CPU that we would be ordering from Wish.com, and that's if the actual legitimate correct CPU turns up and it's not a fake cheap version. So better CPU, 
uh, again, a motherboard that fits that. As far as we're concerned, as long as the motherboard works with the CPU and the RAM and stuff, we all good. So we have an Asus Prime A320MK motherboard, which uh, obviously Fierce PC know is gonna work with your CPU, with your RAM, with your graphics card. So there's nothing to worry about there. Then we have an AMD Radeon RX 580 eight gigabyte graphics card. That's a nice graphics card. Okay, I'm just gonna trust that this website is, you know, at least fairly reputable. So we're looking at these. Okay. Uh huh. Better value, more recent. I'd say that they were fairly. I mean, 56% to 54%. Uh, I would say I would say that these graphics cards are fairly equal. Uh, the 1060 that we ordered from Wish is not going to be a 1060. That is a lie, as we discussed. You're not going to get a 1060 for like 60 pounds or whatever it was. So um, definitely better than that. A 580 is 100% better than the piece of crud that we would get from uh, Wish.com. So that's good. Uh, also, you get three months of uh, Xbox Games Pass with it. Three months of Xbox Games Pass for PC, which is pretty cool. You get loads of games for free, basically, for three months. You can play that. Uh, I've got Xbox Games Pass. There's a bunch of good games on there. Added bonus. Don't get that with the Wish.com. Uh, we've got 8 gig of DDR4, 2666 DDR4 memory. Uh, we also get a terabyte Seagate Barracuda hard drive. Uh, good hard drive, reliable, brand new for definite. Uh, get a copy of Windows 10, which is good. Uh, free internet security and a three year protect warranty. So, and that is only 550 pounds. I mean, I'm rounding up, but 550 pounds. So that's already a good 75 pounds cheaper than the wish.com bundle that we sort of higgledy piggledy put together and probably won't work, won't be what it says it is, maybe just won't arrive, who knows. So that's the equivalent sort of build, I guess. And now let's look a little bit more expensive, shall we? Should we look more at the top end of the budget that we spent? So if you're gonna go and say we spent 625 pounds on the wish.com bundle let's look at how much that full budget would get us so at the minute any of these i didn't even mention the case obviously obviously sorry the red ronin comes with an RB, rgb case uh, you can choose any color so it comes with a game max shadow rgb mid tower tempered glass gaming case and case fans we didn't even look at case fans oh well we didn't even look at case fans with the uh with the wish.com bundle but there we go so obviously we get a nice game max case with that so, with the Iron Wing Banshee, uh, we're sticking more with AMD, sticking similar to uh, the Wish uh, configuration that we made. So we're using the AMD Ryzen 3 2200G, which I think is exactly the same CPU as is listed here. Same CPU, again, motherboard that we know is gonna work because Fierce will sort that out for us. So we have a GTX 1660 60 graphics card. So that's gonna be really good, actually. That's gonna be really good performance. 16 gig of DDR4, 3000 megahertz memory. So this is a big step up now. We're, we're doubling the amount of RAM here uh, compared to the Wish bundle. We're, we're at 16 gig, which is really, really good. Uh, we're getting 250 gig of Seagate, 250 gig Seagate Barracuda solid state drive. So again, SSD, which we didn't get with the Wish one at all. And if you want, you can just add a hard drive to that for probably not a lot of extra money. It's a nice PC. Obviously, again, we're still getting Windows 10 with both of these. We're still getting free internet security and we're still getting the three year warranty. Okay, so overall, don't buy PC parts from Wish.com. They're not gonna be good. They're not gonna be what they say they are. They might not even turn up. They're expensive. They're not a good deal. No matter what it says, it can tell you that it used to be 500 pounds and now it's only 40. It's not true. If you're looking for a PC, check out Fierce PC. They have PCs for all budgets. This was just a little video I wanted to show you because I've seen a lot of people making these videos about Wish.com and they're making a similar style video um, where they're buying all these parts and they're basically showing you guys how it's not a good idea really to do that. I highly recommend Fierce PC. They're great guys. Uh, like I said, you can use code COLSY5 and you'll get 5% off. So it'll be even cheaper. Uh, and you can get some really, really nice builds. The guys are really helpful. So if you have any questions, if you have any specific things that you want to your, if you have any specific things you want your PC to do or you want to include in your PC, then if you talk to them, I'm sure they'll be able to sort you out and they'll figure it out for you. Please do check out Fierce PC. Go and buy your PCs from there. Guys, if you want 
to see a follow-up to this video. If you want me to order these things from Wish and just see what happens, then maybe if this video does well, maybe we could work that out. It's a lot of money to be spending to know that basically it's being thrown away. But if this video does well, if you guys like it, if I can sort it out, maybe we could do that kind of video where we actually build a Wish.com PC and maybe compare it to a fierce PC PC. That would be a pretty good video, so that would be cool to do. Anyway, hope you guys liked the video. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Please do go check out Fierce PC if you're looking for a PC uh, and use code Colsey5. Thank you guys, and I will see you next time.